Yo beautiful, it's Kyle Miller, America's Complete Life Coach, here in Sandy Springs. Obviously, there's cars here in Sandy Springs, and motorcycles. It's a glorious place. And this is a Miracle Monday. Let's go with that, right before Thanksgiving, getting, oh, cashing in those miracles just to make sure everything's ready for Thanksgiving so that we can go into our proper food comas. But the question that I want to answer today is how can how can I give life more meaning, more joy? Even through trials and challenges. And so I I was just really thinking about about this question today and it brought back a good old experience they actually happened like about a couple uh, like a month ago uh, I just uh, started learning about um, interpretation awareness being able to interpret emotions in several different ways and because in the past I've always just just when I like with Mondays like okay so it's Monday I didn't get to bed early I got to bed kind of late I'm really tired already on Monday and I have to go work for 12 hours this is gonna be brutal and I just gave that meaning to that instead of hey this this means that I'll get more sleep tomorrow I, and I'll be able to practice uh, be energized and I mean 12 hours isn't really that long but I, I don't know it's just different thoughts but uh, so interpretation awareness uh, the story I had was uh, about a month ago I um, I received a check on uh, I think it was like Tuesday uh, for my last couple weeks uh, a good um, a good bit <laughs> um, and I it was the last time I used checks <laughs> from this experience, but uh, I put in my uh, pocket, and I learned not to put things in my pocket. Mom, if you're watching this, I am sorry for losing your debit card that way. But anyways, uh, I, um, I, I couldn't find it. I woke up that next morning, and I couldn't find it at all. And I was just kind of skirt, scurrying around, and I was like, where the heck? is my check I don't want to work two weeks just for free for the company like good for them but hey I need my check and so I woke up that morning and I had all these thoughts rushing through and I, I had a thought you can I couldn't find it so I can either let this ruin my day and I just sorrow the rest of it or I can do what I can look for wherever I could ask people for help and just if I can't find it all right I'll have to figure out how to make money out <laughs> uh, make up the money for uh, school and for traveling and all those things so I <laughs> I went throughout the day and I uh, I ended up finding it like around 3 p.m. and I think I uh, I'm I'm somewhat religious so I have faith in God and I know not everyone has it but I express a lot of gratitude for that moment uh, more so I was more grateful for being able to interpret that situation give it different meaning and be able to have a happy day despite that trial so how, how can this help you how can you in those like moments of hopelessness that you can find hope well uh, a little exercise you can do and something that has really helped me is if you're ever in a have a situation in your head write it out and write out what what's the worst situation that could happen from this how, how will you respond to that what's the likely response that you'll uh, likely what's likely to happen and how will you respond to that and what's what is the best result 
and how will you res respond to that and as you do that your problem has several different meanings and you're able to be able to confidently go about your day knowing that you know what to do so beautiful I love you so much keep up the good work and just give the right give the joyful meaning to life peace out